Okay, howdy y'all. Hope y'all can hear me. I'll test the video later before I do it. Whatever. Anyway, today I'm going to do something a little different as far as showing you what I sold over the week. Because I've been moving, so that's why you haven't seen a video. I moved in the same apartment complex, just different apartments. Luckily, I didn't have to move my garage. Um... As I've told y'all, my mother-in-law, I'm selling some stuff for her that was my father-in-law's when he passed away and we combined families and she moved into a three-bedroom with us. So, that's how that's going. It's not bad. I like my mother-in-law. She watches the videos. My wife don't, but my mother-in-law does. So, thanks. Anyway, let's get started. Um, first up, we have... Hi, how y'all doing? Um, and the 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 number I give you as far as the sale will be the gross number before shipping. Um, I still have some things that are paid shipping, and some, most things are free shipping now. But this would include shipping price. So first thing up is cocktails. Uh, motion pictures, 80s, let's see, um, 88, you already graduated, damn, I gave away my age, didn't I, anyway, uh, no, it still didn't, but cassette, so you can sell pretty much anything you want to on eBay, I sold this for $6, of course, I believe that is free shipping, so $6. So I made three dollars off a cassette I've had laying around for years that I haven't played. Next up, I actually found this pair of Brooks by the dumpster. Someone was throwing them away. Perfectly good sole. Just want to show y'all that. The only problem, see the hole right there in the toe? That is the only problem. Now, normally you can get, these are the Beast. How's it, how's it say it on the side? The Beast 20s. I guess this is the year 2020. I got $21.40. I had them for like 40 trying, you know, they're Brooks. Trying to get some money out of them because that hole is the only problem. And if you just run in them, your feet are going to get wet anyway in these things if it's raining. So, but they're, they're, they're really in great condition. I mean, there's a few scuffs on the sides that I probably couldn't show you in the film. But some guy sent me 20 and he was like, they have a hole in them, man. So I was like, you know what? I found them. They were on top of the, someone, when, sometimes when people set stuff out, they know other people might want. They set it out by our dumpster. We have a community dumpster, and people will set them out by the steps, and if you want it, you pick it up and take it home. I've taken several things home. You know, the people, it's pretty much a dumpster, and hey, I don't want this. So anyway, these are size 10 double E, so they're wides. I got $20 for them. $20 I didn't have even free shipping okay I make let me see make probably what $10 after shipping and fees okay I'll take that all day if I could find things and make $10 off them all day I'll do that next up another cassette Frank now, now y'all have to relax for this one Frankie goes to Hollywood welcome to the pleasure dome relax don't do it you can if you want to but if you've heard the song, you know what I'm talking about. But once again, cassette I just had laying around. And I got 1071 for this. This one was worth more than the cocktail one. Hey. Like I said, sitting around, not doing anything for me. So I got a bunch of empty cassette cases speaking of cassettes bunch of black one you know black and clear like that 
Um, some are scuffed. These are, I probably could have, I got some loose tapes I probably could have put them in. But I got, uh oh, ran that price up too high. Wish I ran it up too high. Okay, $26.50. 24 blank cassette blacks. Hope somebody understands that and don't think it was blank cassettes. Anyway, next up, another pair of shoes. Um, I do not remember where I got these. These may have been a part of the um, Josh Rally Roots, not Josh, Drew Rally Roots, Rally Roots shoe buy I bought. I bought two boxes from Drew when he bought them from Rally Roots. Uh, still haven't listed them all. I've gotten real lazy. Need to get back into listing. Anyway, I got $35.10, and I think the shoes were $5 a piece in that box. So, $5 into $35. Next up, Monster Monster Metal Gods. Hey, look, I can see the reflection. No, um, Judas Priest. This is the... Prisoners of Pain album. I've come to find out this is very not really listed on eBay a lot, so I had times trying to comps. But I got six dollars and twenty-five cents. Once again, my music have sitting around for a long time. Alright, I made three dollars off of it. You may say that's that's not worth it. I wouldn't have got this at the used C D D V D bookstore, so I think I did pretty good. And last three things. I'm going to start from the bottom up because the last one I don't want to really mess with. These are some incense cones. Can y'all see those? You know, you put you light the top and they smoke. You put them inside of a little dragon or whatever and they look like they're smoking. Um, went to a yard sale about a year ago about lazy and lady had a whole bunch of incense stuff and I was looking at it you know I'm thinking you know cool if I could get this cheap enough I'm sure I can make some money and I thought I'll take a chance on it and I asked her how much she wanted for it. she said make me an offer and she goes hundred dollars Looked through my money, I had 80. She goes, I'll take it. Now, you may be thinking that's a bad deal, but I've only sold these little incense things so far. I've sold four or five of them at $10 profit per bag. This one I sold for $15.92. So after shipping and fees, around $10. So I've made $10 a bag off just these, and I got five four or five tubs of incense stuff that I can make money off of. So I've almost made my money back and all I've sold is the incense cones. Next up, with damage case that was pictured and noted in the description, my Sims Sky Heroes. Um, this was, I bought a PS3 for my personal use and to make sure I can test PS3 games if I run across them this was one I did not care about so I am selling it and I got seven dollars and thirty cents 319 for shipping fees 354 bucks off a game I didn't care about that was in the bundle and I was gonna buy the PS3 anyway that had 30 games with it last thing I searched market market Facebook Marketplace one time looking for things that were free. Ran across 10 bowling balls. Um, let's see. Two of them had bags. There was a three ball bag and 10 balls. But you had to take everything. There's some cleaner. I sold one locally for $30. Um, th these were all free. Uh, I sold the bag for 50 or 60 um, I've sold all the bag all the balls but one now 
this was the ninth one and I sold this one for someone sent me an offer for $22 I had it for 45 and that's free shipping so it's going I'm only gonna make about $10 off it but it was free off Facebook marketplace once again a don't be afraid to ship heavy items UPS this would be about 10 to 20 10 to I'll say 10 to 15 depending on where it goes it's probably going to be about $12 to ship so I'll make about $12 after fees and everything you know but it was free that's my whole point I found this on Facebook marketplace for free I bought 10 of them I don't know what that is I bought I mean I didn't buy I got 10 of them and other than listing them I got one left and I think I sent an offer for that one all the other ones I sold for 30 or 40 dollars the bag I sold for 60 so I've made probably two hundred dollars off something that was free easily two hundred dollars off something that was free on Facebook marketplace so don't be afraid on large heavy items I mean this ain't a large item this will fit in a 12 by 12 box 12 by 12 by 12 box um, I'll put some styrofoam around it and it will be fine to ship UPS and like I said for about 12 bucks do not ship this USPS it will cost you about twenty three dollars but that's the last thing I sold today and but also like I said that's a good that's a good lesson for you today um, you never know what you can get off Facebook marketplace that you can turn around and sell that you get for free like I've said in other videos don't forget to tell your neighbors what you do maybe they have some stuff that they want to give you and heavy items probably use USPS as we've all seen lately the creek incident with FedEx don't ship FedEx don't ship FedEx either because they will change the total but with that said I'm gonna go from here because it's already a 12 minute video and that's a little longer than I wanted it to be but I ramble too much and that's the problem but I want to say thanks appreciate it I'm up to 28 subscribers now was it 16 so you extra people that came in I appreciate it people that watched to the video give me a peace sign to let you know you watched till the end and love you thank you have a good day like subscribe I appreciate it thumbs up don't forget the thumbs up thanks bye